Hey, what's up my friend? Hope you're doing well today. In this video, I'm going to talk about the hermit phase of spiritual awakening and why this is a great thing. Maybe you've recently gone through some kind of spiritual awakening transformation where you're like experiencing your true nature for the first time. To me, this happened around four years ago. I went through a spiritual awakening and I was sitting at a desk and suddenly I noticed the presence of some other energy and it was so intense and I was like, wow, there's something else here I've never felt before, you know, this is crazy. Now understand what's going on, like with all the spiritual books, you know, what they're talking about. And maybe you have an experience like that as well. And the hermit phase is like, and credits of this term go to Victor Otto, who's a great spiritual teacher that massively helped me on his journey. He also has a YouTube channel, definitely check him out. So credits of this term I learned from him. So um, basically the hermit phase involves a phase where you are more drawn inwards. You're not so much active out there in the world, maybe you experience a lot of emotional releases, fatigue, you sense maybe there's some greater purpose that is there for you and the life you've built so far is not, not in alignment anymore. But at the same time, you're going through so much inner changes, purges and a great transformation that you almost like don't have energy to do anything and you need to rest a lot more. And you're maybe going through a dark night of the soul experience as well. And the hermit phase is more like you're becoming a hermit. You're um, going through lots of inner changes, you know, think about like this archetype of like a sage or something they're like this hermit just goes into a cave and then they return and they're like enlightened and so this is a similar thing for you the hermit phase is your phase of evolving spiritually your phase of undoing and rebirth you know almost like a phoenix like the phoenix that burns and out of the ashes of the new arises the new consciousness the new awareness you're shifting into the 5d the 3d is breaking down the 5d is emerging as within so without so we're seeing this on the collective stage as well right now where we are shifting to a higher vibration and we are all collectively making up we are vibrating together and we are manifesting together what we see in this world you know right now and if we don't like what we're seeing out there we must change it within and so we are light workers awakening right now from the 3d matrix if you will and so part of this process is a process of disconnection right so like we're so in the world and so obsessed with like you know um external things like desires and you know with these conditioned goals we have right and so this phase of spiritual awakening the hermit phase is a retractive where you almost retreat back to yourself and maybe you're reading lots of spiritual books and learning stuff about maybe you're even studying alternative conspiracy information about how the government is messed up and maybe you've seen this in the last three years as well that like the world is not as it seems and it's like it's kind of like an intense phase of your spiritual awakening journey where you might even feel like you're going crazy uh, you might even lose a bunch of friends and stuff and you might be like why do i feel so depressed you know but you know it's not a conventional depression depression but rather spiritual in nature right so um that's the hermit phase of awakening and my suggestion is to just surrender more to accept more what is because what you resist persists like this has been my biggest life lesson to not fight what i what is here you know the more i fight it the more i'm identifying with my current reality you know if i don't like what i'm seeing it's not about fighting what is here because that maintains it you know what you resist persists carl jung said so if you want to increase your vibration First of all, understand that these emotions that you're feeling and releasing, they're not anything bad. It doesn't mean you're attracting negative things. No, this thing is already in your vibration. So literally by accepting it, you're actually releasing it and then you're increasing your vibration. Also, you might notice that your vibration is higher because now you're letting, you're, you're aware of how much darkness there is before. Maybe this spiritual awakening, maybe you were even like a quote unquote average, normal, happy person. Or maybe not, it depends on your journey. Um, but either way what you thought was happy before you now realize was kind of a depressed state I noticed this when I went for an awakening I'm like okay the happiness that I thought was normal was actually a depressed state of being and the real happiness is like exponentially higher beyond the words like it's like crazy the difference um, you know our vibration in society as of now is still very low but we're shifting and this is the hermit phase you're going within Jesus said the kingdom of heaven is within and you're going within right now right so that's why it's a great thing there's no need to rush the process there's no need to hurry up and like oh i need to make money and find my purpose today you know that's just a form of resistance you know so just take it easy my friend surrender relax your vibration will increase like crazy you will manifest great things for me it took a while now like it's a, my third or fourth year or something and now i'm slowly slowly starting to manifest the things i want you know and it took me i knew i wanted to do these videos a while ago 
but I just didn't feel ready for it and it was a process and I got lost in in pursuing wrong things and shiny object syndrome and all these different things my friend you know so my suggestion is to take it easy follow your intuition and you can also implement the morning routine that's why I've got a free morning ritual cheat sheet you can download in the description below and other than that you can check out this other video about spiritual awakening that will help you on your journey peace and much love